of World Cup fever, baby. It's all here. Fast kicking, low scoring, and ties, oh, you bet. Serbia beat Costa Rica, one nothing. Sweden beat South Korea, one nothing. Uruguay beat Egypt, one nothing. And the US beat themselves up for not even qualifying this year. So I, I don't know, root for Iceland. They could use the help. Halfback, passes to the center. Back to the wing. Back to the center. Center holds it. Holds it. Holds it. It's all so thrilling, but not as thrilling as a game of HQ, the live mobile game show where you answer questions to win cash. I am your host in between the goalposts, Cristiano Ronaldo, Scott Rogowski, coming to you live from the greatest city on earth, the city that never sleeps, Moscow. I'm it like Beckham with all 675,000 plus of you in the game right now, including Willa, Ari Barkin, the ultimate wench, Dane Yankovic with a happy birthday, Melody Tagani, Danielle Kane, her best friend or boyfriend, Robbie Diltz, happy birthday to Mackenzie from Kelly, and happy anniversary, Dove and Tammy. Are you hitting the pitch with us for the first time tonight? Let me tell you how it works. I asked 12 questions, they started easy to get harder. If you answer all 12 questions correctly, you win our prize, our cash prize, which tonight is a whopping, oh, flopping, 5,000 Diego Maradonas, 5,000 Danny Alvises, $5,000. With that kind of cash, you can buy 40 official World Cup game balls. They're startlingly expensive. Everything is love here on HQ. We're going ape S hit tonight, setting the missiles off, tricking my inhibitions off. Are you ready to quiz with me and get some money? Open wide for some soccer! Then you know what we gotta do. Let's get down to the nitty gritty with 730,000 plus of you now. Let's get this show on the road with Cumero numero uno. Which of these is typically not found in dessert, ice cream, whipped cream, or shaving cream? I have a sad story to tell you. It may hurt your feelings a bit. Last night when I walked into my bathroom, I stepped in a big pile of shaving cream, shaving cream, be nice and clean, shave every day and you'll always look keen, 712,697 are the cream of the quiz so far. You're getting cute too. In the 1800s, which of these was a service used to send mail in the US? Dragon baskets, Pony Express, or Troll Transfer? You know, for a short time in the 1860s, the fastest way to get your letters across the Old West was with wild, wild horses. Pony Express. Yeah, it lasted only about 18 months. It was put out of business by the Telegraph, but everyone agrees it was super cool. And 675,626 of you aren't horsing around tonight. You're galloping on to queue. Three, a cummerbund is a waistband sash typically worn with which of these outfits? Pajamas, tuxedo, or swimsuit? A cummerbund is a word that should never be split in half. It's also a men's sash worn around the waist that one could wear anytime technically, but traditionally and typically it goes with the penguin suit, the tuxedo, your formal wear, 633,005 of you. Looking spiffy. Cumberbund is probably also what your aunt thinks Benedict Cumberbatch's last name is. No, it's Cumberbatch. We got Q4. What prop is involved in the playground game Double Dutch? Jacks, yo yo, or jump rope? Banana, banana, banana split. What did you get in arithmetic? If you're double dutching, you're busting rhymes and jumping ropes. Come on, two ropes, two chains. Swinging in opposite directions. It's, it's not easy. For me at least, 604,206 of you are gonna pass the duchy on the left hand side. To Q5, on sunscreen bottles, what does the F in SPF stand for? Filter, factor, or feel? Suntan season is reaching the northeast here. Time to make the annual pilgrimage to CVS to buy a, a tube of lotion. SPF 200 for me. At the bare minimum, you should use SPF 15. That's sun protection factor 15. 
Factors Famous Deli, 490,706 are blocking those UVA and UVB rays. You could have the X Factor to win HQ tonight. You're at the halfway point, Q6. Which of these card games comes from the Spanish word for basket? Canasta, Pinochle, or Rummy? Go ahead, crack your Spanish dictionary. SpanishDicks.com, go for it. Type in basket, I'll wait, I'll wait. This is a truly international card game, likely created by two guys from Uruguay. First became popular in the 1940s and 50s. Now there are multiple different versions of Canasta played around the world. Canasta is basket. La Canasta. 365,728 are getting Canasty tonight. And you're getting Q7. In what desert can you find the Burning Man Festival? Black Rock, Mojave, or Baja? We asked about desserts at Q1. Now we're asking about deserts. Burning Man's been running for 32 years, but it feels like much longer if you've ever had to listen to someone talk about it. Any burners out there in the game tonight? Any residents of Black Rock City? That temporary burg that pops up 100 miles north of Reno every year in, wouldn't you know it? The Black Rock Desert. And ooh, ouchie, wowie. Yeah, I'm gonna call a savage question here at Q7. We just lost 285,000 players in a single Fell swoop right there, down to 83,466 who are back in black for Q8. What category is at the top of Abraham Maslow's famous hierarchy of needs pyramid? Safety, love, or self-actualization? Where does the hierarchy of needs pyramid sit on the pyramid pyramids? I would put the Egyptian pyramids at the bottom, and then the food pyramid, and then pyramid schemes, and then human pyramid, then the $100,000 pyramid, and then Maslow's pyramid at the top. The most basic physiological needs are at the bottom of his pyramid, food and shelter, then safety, security, then friends and family, self-esteem and respect. And if you master all those, well, you are self-actualized, my good sir or madam. Self-actualization. What a man can be, he must be. 64,526 are actually still in this game. They could be winning it tonight. You're getting Q9. What U.S. state's official cartoon character first appeared on local weather segments? Illinois, Maryland, or Oklahoma? Apparently, you can declare an official state anything, as this state proved, when Gusty, created by weatherman Don Woods to spruce up his forecast, was named the official cartoon of Oklahoma, where the wind comes sweeping down the plain. Boomer, Sooner, Oklahoma's your answer here. 26,036 of you are getting swept up in a gust of wind to Q10. In the biblical tale, Herod offers Salome whatever she wishes after she does what? Vanquishes his enemy, makes him laugh, or dances for him. Oh, this one's a gimme for all you opera heads out there. Where you at? Richard Strauss's Salome? Come on. What did Salome want? John the Baptist's head. And how did she want it? On a platter. And what did she do to get it? The dance of the seven veils. Well, that's what Strauss called it. The Bible didn't have a name for it, but she danced. You could have danced all night. 17,916 just dance to Q11. Which of these rivers runs through the fewest countries? Colorado, Euphrates, or Volga? Salome, Salome, Salome. Shout out H. Cuba Gooding Sr. and the main ingredient here, Euphrates. The Euphrates River hits Syria, Iraq, and Turkey. That's three countries. The Colorado winds through the southern United States and reaches Mexico. That's two. But the Volga, Europe's longest and Russia's proudest, runs through Russia and Russia alone. 5,157. Getting this one right. It empties into the Caspian Sea. We have 5,157 prince and princess Caspians surrendering to the flow tonight for Q12. This is it, the final round. It all boils down to this. We started with oh, over 700,000 of you. We're down to just 5,157 who could be splitting $5,000 if you answer me. This Q12. Which of these authors was not credited in the 1946 film The Big Sleep? Truman Capote, William Faulkner, or Raymond Chandler? My, my, my. Such a lot of cues around town and so few brains. Mm.
It's one of the all-time great film noirs, starring real-life husband and wife Bogey and Bacall. Now, Raymond Chandler wrote the original Philip Marlowe detective novel in 1939. It was too saucy for the big screen, however, so William Faulkner was hired to tone it down. Now, Faulkner received a screenplay credit with two others, and Chandler got that story by credit, but Truman Capote had nothing to do with the big sleep and 4,167 are going to be sleeping well tonight because there are big winners, baby! You're wide awake! Bop, bop, bop. Yeah, not sleeping tonight, 4,167 of you HQDs splitting five Gs. G-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-g-